morning kids okay not morning kids actually hello evening kids i um just got home from rehearsing with rosero on something new that i'm gonna be presenting to you guys pretty soon um i usually do written blogs but i decided to do a vlog this week and just try it out and see how it is I i've gotten real old school to the point where i'm like it i don't even i, I don't even know how i'm gonna transfer this off my computer onto online in this huge file, but I'm going to figure it out. Anyway, um, I'm really excited because I'm about to go to Atlanta to finish my mixtape this week. Very, very much so looking forward to that. It's been something I've been trying to like kind of hurry up and put the cap on for a minute. But I had to get so many other eggs in order and finish up stuff for the album and also have film and TV stuff that I have to work on. And getting ready to go pimp, uh, film Pimp right after I leave Atlanta so a lot of different things going on but most of all staying focused staying on my diet this week I ended up gaining more Kiersey's calling me this um week I gained a little bit more fat than I, than I should have because I was eating too much oily stuff but I'll get through it um what else has been going on my parents moved into a new house so I was excited to go see them and everything like that I um I love those guys. Literally, I was thinking, because I, I got into a fight with my sister and my brother over there. They were saying some stuff that was like, just being regular kids, you know, saying stuff. And I was just being a regular older sister, like, uh, you know, reprimanding them. And I felt badly about it because, you know, they were making a joke towards my mom. And they, of course, didn't mean anything by it. But, you know, I guess as I've gotten older, I've realized all the pressures that you might have as a parent. And then, oops. And then on top of that, I think about as a kid, the fact that I'm not going to have my parents, well, not a kid, but as a young woman, I'm not going to have my parents forever. So imagine now, you know, realizing my own adult pressures or things that I'm having, responsibilities I'm having to deal with, imagining how they make me feel, then thinking of my mother, then thinking of the fact she has kids, and then all of those things at once. It's like, now I'm so much more sensitive of any added stress that may come on her, and I want her to be around, I don't want her to get, you know, any high blood pressure, high anxiety, or anything like that, you know. So when I feel as if they picking on her, or some, you know, I, I've, I've gotten, I become that older sister that I didn't know that I could be, and you know, I ended up going in on them lightly, not majorly, but lightly. And um, my sister ended up sending me a text earlier today, and she was telling me that she understood and that she was sorry if it got taken the wrong way. And my little brother also posted a picture on his. He's such a boy about it. Like she said, she actually contacted me, and then he posted a picture of uh, our family and said he's always surrounded by people who love him. And it, it made me feel good because I felt like he was letting me know that, like, even if we got to that fight the other day, that he knows that we love him, that everything we do is is for that. And so it's like, you know, it's very special the relationship you have with your siblings and the di different dynamics of them. And I like being a big sister. And I like, you know, guiding them and assisting them. And, I also like learning from them too. So I'm very grateful to have that relationship. Um, what else has been going on? Kashan came back from Cuba. She really inspired me going, going to Cuba. I've always wanted to go somewhere independently, you know, like fly somewhere. But I think I've always been afraid just for the simple reasons of that people try to make you feel afraid in general. And then also, you know, because of my celebrityism. Not trying to say that I'm going to, that I'm just so dang on famous everywhere. But, you know, you grow up, my parents put a lot of pressure on me as a kid when I would go places like, you got to be careful, you can't go everywhere. So I think a little bit of that sticks with me. But eventually I know at some point I'm going to figure out a way to go somewhere and do that and, you know, give myself that push of just independently experiencing a culture on my own. Um, excited for Scream Queens. It's not coming till June, though. I'm really nervous about Pimp, to be honest. I'm really going to have to get into a crazy headspace in order to, uh, you know, really give my best performance for this, which is, of course, not an option, hashtag Virgo. Having to finish up this book, uh, I Don't Belong to You, I'm supposed to finish my entire man manuscript within the next couple of days, 10 chapters, I'm only on the 6th. <sighs> Anyhow, it's a blessing, because Sean's calling me now. 
I'm thankful and I'm just again moving forward and just sending you then you guys ask Kiki. I know sometimes you think I'm not there, not responding, but I'm there and you know, I'm glad that you guys are enjoying the site. It's really cool to see how, you know, far it's come since the first, you know, me starting it re rebooting it again. The last time I had a real website was when I was probably a <laughs> adolescent. My mom was running it. So it's really fun to be able to have a place where I can share with y'all and you know be more connected. It's exciting because everything I do in my work, I want to make sure that it's what's the word I'm looking for. It's a good representation of what's happening with us. Of course, it's my own perspective, but I really love communicating as much as I can because sometimes when you're in your own bubble of what you're doing, you're not able to realize everything that's happening around you. So Snapchat and all that stuff, Twitter and stuff, it's really dope because I feel like y'all get to know me, but I also get to know y'all and I don't know. It's interesting this whole thing how it works, but I'm a real like connected type person. I like connecting. I like learning. So it's cool to me. Hope y'all enjoying the ride too. Holla at your girl.